okay now we need to create a uh, our spine rig so in order to create the spine rig we need to create joints again create a joint come to the front view and start putting them like for example this is our lower spine and then control click and drag control click and drag and then this is our mid spine this is our chest this is the neck and this is upper neck and then this is head joint so let's arrange them first so that we can have a clear hierarchy so we can readjust them later also For example, this is our called uh, this one. We enable axis and move it a little bit down. Somewhat here. And then this one a little bit down here also. And I think we need to add here one more. Which we can just by clicking this like this. Putting this here. And move it down here. And select all of them first and just go up to object and make custom length 1 and custom bones to 1. In fact 0.5 is better. It's even more smaller. Let's align them properly on the right position. So switch off this enable axis, move it back. Enable axis again so I can adjust the bones come to the left view board yeah this is my neck joint it should be somewhat here and this this should be a little bit back and then this is my top joint should be somewhere here head end okay and then this 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 is my chest actually So what I'm doing is I'm selecting each joint now and position it properly so it is on the right place of its hierarchy as following the spine. Okay and start naming them now. So now we need to add controllers to this so we move these bones to the bone section and also try to put it connect to the hips also. So now we need to add a creator controllers for our other things. Okay. So I will hide a mesh for right for some moment and create the controllers. For example, I will create my hip controller first, which needs to be simple looking. So I'll just create a rectangle and scale it down. Switch my mesh back so I can see the size of my controller. I need to snap this joint, uh, this, uh, I need to center the axis first, 
mesh command axis center center axis 2 and then snap it to the bone hip bone and then I need to switch on my and create a nice shape Might be create controllers, uh, create point, isolate it, and just create a bunch of point. I'm just trying to create uh, some uh, some different random shape to make it look visually different. Okay, and then we just come here and hide our bones. Uh, sorry, we need to select all of our bones and put them inside bone section. So once we hide bones, all the bones are get hide hidden. Perfect. So now this is our hip controller. So it needs to be attached to the hip. So what we'll do is we just call it and put it in the controllers. Call it CLT underscore hip and both our thighs and stays there and uh, yes what we do is first of all we just come here select our control hip and make it freeze all select our bone hip and character tags constraint and we give it a PSR constraint and then we just come here at control hip so now you can see that the hip is being controlled through this perfect we can move our hip so next thing is we need to create controllers for our spine so for spine we just create circles and reduce them change their direction to x z and snap it to the respective points and switch on my mesh so we can see the size it's not too big or too small this is fine I think and just make it a little bit elliptic and reduce it on this size and hide our mesh and just control and drag and snap to the next one control drag snap to the next one control drag snap to the next one okay so for to create a different between the chest and the other controllers so we need to create a different chest controller okay so this is our chest controller okay now we need to name them like this is CLT underscore lower spine then CLT underscore mid spine upper 
spine and then CLT underscore chest okay so chest goes under upper spine upper spine goes under mid spine mid spine goes under lower spine see chest is not its own right place so I need to move it switch off my mesh I need to move this axis so what I will do now is enable axis and snap to to the right place and I will change the color select my chest and use on and change it to yellow and these three to might be green and my this right side to be left side to be blue or red and this side to be blue and then this to be yellow also okay so it looks more interesting okay now we need to connect to the bones so how we'll do is simple we just switch off our mesh and create the constraints for the joints so for example this is lower spine character tag constraint and we add PSR constraint and then we add our before I create joints just so make sure they all are have zero zero coordinates so freeze all of them so lower spine add PSR lower spine you can see now this spine is working fine similarly we just come here add another constraint to PSR and add uh, this mid spine constraint and character drag constraint PSR and this time we upper spine constraint okay and the last not the least constraint PSR and chest constraint so let me make sure everything is working fine everything is working fine make sure hip is working fine hip is also working fine and now we need to create controllers for our neck and head so how we can do that is just create simple circle and put it XZ hide mesh uh, and link it to our neck and what we'll do is select uh, collapse this one and select our points and move the controller as per our 
visual representation of a neck somewhat like this make sure we are moving the points not the object because our object has an axis which is snapped to this neck area okay and now next is the head joint so we just come here duplicate might be this one and move it to the next one okay and similarly we just come here to the points and move our points to the top level and make it hard so it looks different a little bit okay and this is our CLT underscore neck sorry head and this is CLT underscore neck and we put it under the controllers mm. so head under goes under neck and neck goes under chest and these two also needs to have freeze all coordinates similarly go to their height the depot uh, now and go to their respective bones which is chest connect tags constraint duplicate the same constraint select both of them make psr now go to the neck and add neck here add neck here and head here okay and you have a very easy rig ready we can create squash and stretch also but at the moment we will not focus on squash and stretch